All right, I've got a little fun trick here for your shower in an RV. If you have a shower inside your RV, more than likely it's pretty small. As is ours, we have a corner shower and the whole time you take a shower, you spend more time wrestling with a shower curtain than you do actually taking a shower. So it was getting really frustrating. So I looked into all sorts of options, including buying a curtain rod that would extend out from the current curtain rod that looks like this and into the room. And I would have had to drill holes and mount it into my wall. Not wanting to do that, I came up with this other idea. First of all, I picked up a shower curtain from Target, something cuter than what came with the RV. And you can use the one that came with the RV unless you have a plastic one, but just have something that's a, a waterproof fabric. And I picked up a couple shoelaces, a couple white shoelaces to match my curtain. And I pinned it onto the shower curtain in two different places, you'll see that. And I used a safety pin on the other side of the curtain so you can see how I pinned it on there. So that way I can take it off if I need to as well when I go to wash the shower curtain. Then I picked up some clear 3M command strips with the clear hook, just a small one. And I hooked two of those on opposite walls inside of our bathroom. And those come off real easily and they won't leave any marking on your wall, hopefully. Uh, you might want to test that on your own wall first before you do this, but then I take the shoestring and I have a little knot at the end of it and I have kept it so I can adjust it depending on how much room I want inside the shower. And so I made a little slip knot and I kept the tail on so I can adjust it and I hook one on that end and it pulls out the shower curtain and then I hook another one on this end and it pulls out the shower curtain close to about 8 to 10 inches so I have quite a bit more room there. And I also have enough room on each side of where the safety pins are so that the shower curtain extends to the side of the wall. You could think about putting a little piece of Velcro on this further edge so that you make sure that it stays shut. But we haven't had any problem as long as you just have enough shower curtain there so you're not flooding your bathroom. Anyways, hope you enjoyed this little tip. It was pretty cheap and a lot easier than mounting a new shower curtain rod.